fresh era, the, the death of the, the territories, the, the death of the frontiers. We have a whole red generation that's still coming out of the Cold War, mm -hmm. and then still other getting into the Internet Revolution. But in a few generations, those people that would, would have grown to influences from any side of the world, you won't be able to fool them. Territory, nationality, religious orientation, is this something old, something from the past? Mm -hmm. Today is community, a worldwide community. This is me opening my internet on my phone, on my laptop. This is me connecting to the entire world mm -hmm. and realizing through it that an individual on the other side of the planet has the same concerns that I do. Veteran girl fighters of the Civil War nine years ago are now in their mid-twenties. Both know what it means to kill. When I was uh, fighting, I felt myself that I'm protecting myself and my family. Yani, uh, I don't like to kill people just for killing people. I like uh, to kill peop people just to protect myself and my family and the Christian people. The less modern you are, the more afraid you are to move. The, their country, their governments, everyone try to tell them, stay. Here you are safe. Mm -hmm. Your country is safe. Do not go elsewhere. Outside is strange. Outside, Outside is scary. Yeah. Outside is bad. Uh, I don't believe that at all. Moving is good. Moving is evolving. Uh, meeting other culture is important. It's essential. Mm -hmm. Exchanging ideas, even ideas with whom you are totally opposed to mm -hmm. is very constructive because it just puts you out of your context. Exchange. So this is today. This mm -hmm. is what today and the internet and the natural evolution of men have brought you to. Mm -hmm. So when people try to put fear into your heart or trap you in, uh, or excite your notion of nationalism, it's from the past. Mm -hmm. We give power to people to rule on our lives. Yeah. We mustn't empower people that harm us. Mm -hmm. Lebanon by miracle because of all those multiple religion does not affect your life religiously because the Muslim must tolerate the Christians, the Christian must tolerate the Dirzi, the Dirzi, so they won't come and tell you how to live. Right. As you see, I have in Beirut an isle of freedom because of all those communities, which is great. Mm -hmm. Shia bombs Sunni, Sunni bombs uh, Shia. Uh, they're not killing each other today on the streets. Why? Because my neighbor is Sunni, my neighbor is Shia. My... I'm not going to kill you. I know you. Mm. I know you're not the devil. I don't mind not reaching a lot. I mind reaching a little, a little group. If I reach a little group, it's great. Because this little group uh, spreads my music to other little groups. I mean... I never met you, we never saw each other, and you came to me. Why? How come? Maybe my music brought you to me. Mm -hmm. Not being a popular a pop star, mm -hmm. it's okay. My achievement is leaving eggs that hatch into something beneficial. Nice. behind everything is fine and there'll be no more crime let the country shine with general Suleiman. general Suleiman is like a children's song every children they have a hero mm -hmm. and general Suleiman is this hero that brings peace to the country that sends all the warlords and the weapon dealer and all those bad guys, he sends them home. And everybody prays General Sleiman is like the best military guy we can... Is this is a have. character you created or...? It's our president. Oh, is it? He became president. Oh, really? At the time, I wrote the song, he was general. Okay. When, when was that? When did you do that song? In 2008. 2008. 
they found me in 2010. This is, there was a guy on the internet mocking me. He said, internet in Lebanon is so slow. He did a song in 2008, they caught him in 2009. <laughs> Every time they needed to download the video. <laughs> To you. <laughs> they just put me in jail for like eight hours. But there was such a big fuss on the internet worldwide that the government and the presidential palace they didn't want this publicity. Right. It was not worth it. This song is so stupid and harmless. It was not worth the bad publicity the country had. educated judge that went to high school, had a degree, had a diploma, and became head of the law in Lebanon, heard my song, and thought this is a threat to <laughs> Lebanon. National security. Can I just, this, this, does this give you an, an idea of the level of our leaders? Right. It's a shame. They tried to use the law to imprison me. The law said you cannot insult the president. The song was he was never in insulting. It's a song for children. There's no, a mama could teach the kid the song. There's no insult in it. Right. Then I thought, okay, maybe it's go home, the insult. So you're going to jail me because I told you go home. Mm. Just stupid, you know? In fact, it's fear. Maybe they thought that, oh, this is the start of the revolution in Lebanon. That's the, that's the power you were talking about, the music, you know. It, it has the power that. of the song. It reaches people. Right. I told you are one. Mm. This is how we have to think today. Not this is our leader, this is our country. This is nothing. We are the same family. We have to care and protect each other. And I know I may sound like a hippie, but this is natural, you know? It's... Thank you.